Hi guys, Donald here. I have a brilliant, quick, simple and healthy little recipe to keep you warm during these colder winter months. It's a corn chowder, it's very, very easy to make and best of all, it is luscious, creamy and sweet. It starts off with cutting up some celery and some onion. Now if you're looking for the recipe, it is on jamieoliver.com, so head over and check it out. Once you have that celery and onion chopped up, get a little drop of olive oil into a large pot. A little drop goes in and once that's nice and warm, get your celery and your onion straight in there. You want to fry this off until it's nice, soft and tender, but the extra dimension of flavour I'm going to add in here is a little bit of pine leaves and this will give you the most beautiful aromatic flavour and just really build the base flavours of this soup. It only takes a few ingredients to make something very, very simple, very healthy and totally delicious. While that's frying off, I'm going to chop up my potato. Now, you can use a waxy or a floury potato here. It depends how you like the finish on your soup. But I'm using one that has a nice combination of the two. So I'm going to peel that up and give it a quick peel on the outside and then just chop it into cubes. In terms of size of the little cubes you're going to make, you just want small enough bite-sized pieces that make this a very hearty cheddar. Very nice. Time to check on my onion and my celery and it is looking and smelling very good. So at this point, it's time to make the creamy element of this wonderful soup. So in with a little bit of plain flour. And essentially, this is going to help to thicken this soup and give you a really kind of creamy and rich chowder. So stir that straight through. Now I'm using low fat milk, add that in, and the flour and the milk are going to act together and give you this wonderful, rich and creamy finish to the soup. Once that's nicely combined, grab up your potatoes and just chuck them straight in. You want to cook these potatoes for about 12 minutes, but you want them to be tender, but not mushy. They need to be holding their shape. My potatoes are nearly cooked, so now it's time to chop up some spring onions nice and fine. Straight into the pot. It adds brilliant color in through that white mixture. And then for our lovely sweetness, a bit of sweet corn. Give that all a good stir through and it is time to taste. So grab up a little bit of sweet corn, a little potato, some spring onion in there and give it a taste. What is absolutely brilliant about this recipe is that you're taking just a few key little ingredients that are full of flavour, making something that is really healthy and it results in the most delicious hearty chowder that is sweet and luscious and creamy, all the things you want it to be. It is very, very easy to make. So now I'm going to serve it up into a bowl. Finish it off with some chopped chives and little parmesan crisps for a bit of bite. It is a really simple and healthy recipe and if you want to check it out in the box below, head over to jamieoliver.com, you'll find lots of delicious healthy recipes. And if you want more healthy recipe videos, subscribe to FoodTube, there's lots of lovely things going on. And click subscribe to my channel, we've got lots of brilliant recipes over there as well. I hope you give this recipe a go, so leave me a big comment in the box below and I'll see you soon.